مسنون سامي within the mother earth lie the sacred veins of holy ochre clay breathed upon and awoken we are of the waters of the crystal We remember why we pray to you to create and promote awareness on land that is sacred. We, we're there to pray, we're there to pay homage, we're there to say hello to Mother Earth and, and Father and Sky. Father Sky. It's where creation is important that we understand where we came from and how we were created and how beautiful life is, how we could communicate with the animals, the plants, the birds. Because all you have to do is stick the seed in the ground. <laughs> Maybe help it a little bit in your It gives you something. It's beautiful, beautiful. 
relationship to the earth, in relationship to nations, in relationship to nations. There's words that are given within tradition, shape-shifting and changing into other forms. And this goes beyond the mental construct of, of the two dimensions. We all have a sense of belonging because of our teachings that allow us to be rooted in one place. To know that sense of belonging is base, because you can always go back. So for me, you know, Zuni will always be that place where my, what they call where your cord is, you know, your umbilical cord. So that puts you, there's, there's this whole thing about, you know, belly buttons and your sense of belonging. It's always interesting to talk about those things that establish your place in this universe. I think for many of us who are from this region, the Colorado Plateau, you know, many of us have our core buried deep within that place. And so we are related in that way. And just as we were asked that questions about the newness of who we are in present day life, we go back to those roots. We go back to the authenticity, the covenant that was given to us when we were deep within the earth. And what we carried out was the, the courage, courage to be who we are. We are. People, ready to come for peace. For me, the biggest question has been, how do we get past all the, all the junk? How do we overcome these things that keep either distracting us or taking us away or hurting us? Ready to come for peace. The color red is about thinking of today, the creation of who we are as individuals, the growth that is inherent and is ever-changing. For in Zuni, red is the color of growth. Red is the color of peace. They tried to bury us, but they didn't know it was seeds. They tried to bury us, but they didn't know it was seeds. They tried to bury us, but they didn't but they didn't know we were seeds. They tried to bury us. But they didn't know. But they didn't know. They tried to bury us. But they didn't know. But they didn't know. We were seeds. We were seeds. We were seeds. We were seeds.
will speak to each other in many languages, invoke orishas, share espiritu and god tongue, teach our children to love, to love, seek justice, fight for human peace and believe in themselves so that they may lift the earth up high with their strong little fleshy hands in multi-hues lift the earth to unfathomable heights into a brand new day through music through knowledge through understanding and tolerance and so much love so much love so much love lift the earth
creation story was that my plan was the first to be created by the creator from water and mud, sand, molded. As a two legs are supposed to reflect and mirror everything that is out there about Mother Earth.
once within the Grand Canyon, a majestic, we had once lived. One that was so large that with its wings spread, it could touch all the walls of the Grand Canyon. that lived there revered this winged one. So the, this magnificent winged one spoke with the people and the people spoke with this winged one. And they said because of your majesty and power, may we have a privilege to climb on your wings and fly with you. The winged one laid flat on the ground and allowed for the wings to spread. The people climbed on it that wanted to ride. As indigenous women of the Americas, we understand the responsibilities toward the sacred system of life given to us by the Creator to protect the territorial integrity of Mother Earth and indigenous peoples. These responsibilities include the safety, health, and well-being of our children and those yet to come, as well as the children of all of our non-human relatives the seeds of the plants and those unseen. These responsibilities demand that we act to ensure healthy air, water, soil, seeds, and a safe climate so that life may continue. Es como, es como, 
es como cambiar intercambio de nombre entonces le digo mi nombre y, y, y tomo su nombre de la planta Ajá, para que la, cuando yo voy a comer esté ácido, esté amado ยักษ์ไหนสักยักษ์กระดานาเทสโกอินดีกายกระโดดสนะอูกะทิสนะอามะนาไดกะเอหินสนะอูจิเรียตัสกยักษ์เชลุโอสตาเกสติอูโดด
tornadoes, species extinction. Because of what our species has done, Mother Earth has lost half of her species since 1960. Epidemic rates of cancers and autoimmune diseases, the poison and privatization of fresh waters and lakes, rivers, streams, and aquifers, as well as polluted air and soil. Additionally, genetically modified seeds and life forms have been created which threaten to destroy the sacred system of life that has taken millions of years to achieve in its present state. We understand that the system of laws in many governments around the world have been crafted to support an economic and corporate system that is destroying the ability of life to exist in a manner in which it has existed for millennia. The economic system of the world has exploited and abused nature, pushing Mother Earth to her limits. So much that the system has accelerated dangerous and fundamental changes in the climate. Mother Earth is the source of life which needs to be protected, not a resource to be exploited and commodified as natural capital. We are seeing the world expanding the commodification, financialization, and privatization of the functions of Mother Earth that places a price on forests, air, soils, biodiversity, and nature, causing more inequality and destruction of nature and the environment. We cannot put the future of nature and humanity in the hands of financial speculative mechanisms like carbon trading and red. So to be able to find a place that you're so comfortable, that is sacred, and that you're able to channel energy means a lot regionally, and it means a lot to people who live in that area. Is that is our land, that is our home, that is our home base, that is where our heart is buried underneath. We feel a connection to it, we've always felt a connection to it, and that is everybody's right to have with their sacred places, with their places of prayer, that they should have the ability to protect that land because they want to. Sacred sites for everybody are so important. a need to express that and that it's not always about using it to harm people, it's more about protection of peace and building ourselves up to be able to be strong enough to be a person of peace so that when the challenging moment arises that, that, that we don't get pulled into it we don't get, and do something rash, harmful, you know, that's our words, you know, that's our actions. for blood, oil for blood, making you rich, you soil my love, oil for blood, oil for blood, my mother is clean, that oil is mud, keystone, everything's red, pipeline, now everything's dead, keystone, everything's red, pipeline, now everything's dead, everything's red, everything's red, 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 dead, red, dead, red, Ah. Uh.
I came home from college and I just saw this junkyard and I just told my dad, can you move those cars so I can make a garden right there? And he did. Grow gardens, love children, listen, listen, listen to the stones, listen to the trees, telling creation stories. Grow gardens, love children, listen, listen. Listen to the stones, listen to the trees telling creation stories. For though we have a long way to go, the seeds of revolution have been sown. So we sing to them, grow, grow, grow. Grow, grow, grow. Indigenous women of the Americas, defenders of Mother Earth, defenders of Mother Earth, we are defenders our of Mother Earth. We understand the responsibilities towards the sacred system of life given to us by the Creator. Within the natural laws and creative principles of Mother Earth and Father Sky, Mother Earth and Father Sky, Mother Earth and Father to protect Sky. the territorial integrity of Mother Earth and the indigenous Mother peoples. Mother Earth and Father Sky. We are raising our voices. These responsibilities include the safety, health, 
and well-being of our children and those yet to come, yet to come. as well as the children of all of our non-human relatives, we are raising our the voices. seeds of the plants and those unseen, the seeds of the plant and those unseen, of all of our non-human relatives, the seeds of the plants and those unseen. These responsibilities demand that we act to ensure healthy air, water, water soil, soil, seeds, and a safe climate so that life may continue. So that life may continue. May continue. So that life may continue. We invite all women of the world to join us, your indigenous sisters of the Americas, to put a stop to the destruction. To the destruction. We are drawing the line and saying that the harms stop here and now. Here and now. And that the here harms and stop here and now. Here and now. Here and now. We are raising our voices. No more fossil fuel infrastructure or extraction. Sea level rise. Devastating fires. No more genetically modified organisms. Floods. Extreme heat. Cyclones. Hurricanes. No more toxins in our water, soil, and air. Tornadoes. Species extinction. No more commodifying and privatizing of the earth, air, water, soil, and natural systems. Put a stop to the destruction. We are raising our voices. The harms stop here and now. We are raising our voices. Get up, stand up, stand up for your right.
Thank you so much, everyone, for joining us this evening. We'd love to welcome you to follow the artists to the back of the house and greet and speak with them there. We have to clear the chairs for another show this evening, but thank you, and please join us at the back to greet the artists and speak with them further. Have a great night.